Hey there, friends. Thanks for checking in. Today, we're looking at a Kimber K6S 6-shot 357 Magnum revolver. Kimber's first. Now, I remember a couple years ago when Kimber first introduced the K6S, it generated a lot of excitement. People flooded to the Kimber booth to take a look at it. And Kimber dedicated a whole wall to the K6S. Had to be 25 revolvers on that wall. And the crowds were five to six people deep. Everybody wanting to take a look at this revolver. When I finally broke through the crowd to get my hands on it, I was amazed at how small and light it was. For a six-shot 357 Magnum, I, I, was, I was amazed. And this is the world's smallest in production Six shot, 357 Magnum, right here, the K6S. They make various models of these. This one is the LG model, which stands for laser grip. So we take a look at the grip there. It's a black slate wood, diamond checkering on the grip panels. And over here, we have a Crimson Trace laser built right into the grip. And this whole part of the grip is a heavy rubber. So as you grip it, you get a real nice feel to it. You put a little bit of pressure on there, and it activates the laser. And Crimson Trace sights in the laser, factory set, sighted in at 50 feet. So when I align it along a wall, it aligns perfectly with the front sight. And when I took it to the range, it was raining out. I had complete control of this revolver. It, it, it felt great. And in the back here, we have some serrations. Very beautiful looking revolver. Enclosed hammer. All right, I'll go ahead. There's your six, six shots in the cylinder. Now, the enclosed hammer suits two purposes. First off, it makes the entire gun snag free. All right, double action only, match grade trigger. All right, set at, in my opinion, 10 pounds. The website says nine and a half to 10 and a half pounds. It feels pretty solid 10 pounds to me and it's a smooth pull even even for double taps it's it's pretty sharp i'll go ahead and turn the laser off it has a little switch down here and it's intentionally built into the grip so you don't mistakenly turn it on or off and now i've got it off but the i was i'm impressed with the trigger now i, I measure it up with other revolvers and here we have my Ruger SP-101. The double action pull feels closer to, to 12 pounds. All right, this one's a little bit lighter. The gun itself is, is very much lighter, but I really like the way that trigger feels. Another advantage to the enclosed hammer is that you can put three dot sights on there. See that? Semi-auto shooters who like those three dots make a real nice setup for the K6S. And, and it just felt so normal at the range. Brushed stainless frame. We've got the cylinder release right there, heavily serrated. All right, and there's your six shots. Two inch barrel, three dot sights, 23 ounces, laser activated grip. Match grade trigger. It's a, it's a nice setup. Now in the box, Kimber gives you a pouch right here. All right, and I like these. It, it keeps the gun from bouncing around the range bag. Also comes with a speed strip. And it's a nice setup. And, and people say, well, you know, does it have holster support? Well, yeah, here we have a DeSantis leather holster. Fits in there perfectly. So it's a nice setup. Great for concealed carry. It's snag free. Those who like to, to pocket carry. This is light, and of course you get that additional round compared to most other revolvers. Let's break the scale out. We'll check it out. The unloaded and the loaded weight. Throw some 357 Magnum and see what this thing's weighing in at. Here we have an unloaded K6S on the scale, weighing in at 23 and 7 eighths ounces. That additional 7 eighths of an ounce is coming from the Crimson Trace laser grip. Now here we have a Kimber speed loader. See that K right there? Nice setup. We'll just go ahead and pop these rounds in. 357 Magnum, little twist with the speed loader, and there we go. Six rounds, once again. Weighing in at 
26 and 7 eighths ounces. So it's a nice weight for concealed carry. There it is, Kimber K6S. I took it to the range, put 100 rounds of Fiocchi, 125 grain, soft jacketed hollow points through it, and it functioned excellent. Yeah, it punches you back a little bit, especially for a revolver with this weight, this light weight, but it was accurate, it was reliable, and I love the function and the looks of this revolver. I find it second to none, and I look forward to more quality time at the range with this revolver. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate the thumbs up button. Thanks for watching, and you guys be safe.